So most likely by now, you heard of Mark Rober, a smart guy who creates builds like... Oh, that's amazing. Yeah, you get the idea. But how does he really make them? He has this procedure for every build that he makes, which are the big secrets, 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 which you can <laughs> learn and make by watching till the end of this video. Welcome to the master class. Let's expose him. From all of his videos and his master class, I've taken notes like an FBI agent about how he sets him up for success. So the secret that Mark uses to make an amazing build is a four step process that I call burp. Let's walk through each alphabet. Okay, so the first step is, yeah, why don't we just let the guy on the chair describe? That was close. <laughs> Firstly, the brainstorm stage. This is where you think and write about three things. The location, the problem, the problems that you have in that place, and finally, the solution. Thinking about the solution of that problem where you might be. This shows the location. This is the problem. And finally, think about how you can solve the problem by making something that might be mechanical or electrical. Meanwhile, Oh, come on. So to give an example, I have followed all of these ideas to tell in this video and make a Mark Rober style build. So I have thought of a dish waiter 2.0, a machine that brings up and down to its origin point when a tiny button is pressed. The next process is to research the solution that you thought about in that previous state. This is where you can butt in or butt out the ideas of the build. Like if you thought about something, but it now looks like it is not going to work, you can fall back into another solution or even sometimes even a new topic, but do not lose hope. They're most likely answers around the web. Google never lies. That was a joke. Okay, so in the research stage, I've thought of ideas that I can finesse this task of bringing the dishes up and down. So I legit made a pulley system. Shh, editor, this is for the prototype stage. Finally, things are starting to get a little more interesting because this is where you apply the knowledge from those research and some rough sketches that you might have done for the final build. But make just a little version of it or make a single mechanism that tests your theory. So you guessed it. I found a way how a pulley works and made a live functioning pulley system which was so cool and out of this world. And now the final stage you and I have been waiting for. But before we move on to the last stage, can you just hit that like button and the subscribe button? So now we finally put our minds to making the final product or we could say the final build itself. So I've made Dishubator 2.0 and it's right over. Ha! I'm joking. I will show that in another video with full commentary. This video gets 100 likes, but trust me, it is super cool. Like and sub to not miss this invention though. Now you've learned the full process of how Mark's build is every single invention, but do you know how to start robotics? If not, you can start by clicking right over here.